tag is the procrastinating tag. I am a massive procrastination fan. So today's tag is a little bit in link with that and it's nine questions that I found on the Makeup Honey blog website and they have like a massive, massive list of tags. Um, so I will definitely be featuring them quite a lot. If you see me looking down at all, I've got all the questions um, on the iPad here. I never, ever, ever do body lotion. Um, I probably should do body lotion or body exfoliation as well. Um, I normally just get in the shower and then do my shower gel and then get out and dry. So it's either body lotion um, or sort of body exfoliation. What else do I do? I also don't dry my hair. No. <laughs> well, I just never have the time. I have so, so many brushes. To do it all and let them dry and not want to use anything would be a hell. Also really bad at this, I can go for ages. Because my nails are gel nails and I get them done at the nail bar, when they chip there's not really a lot I can do. If they like chunk off really, really badly, what I'll do is when I get home, that like the moment I can get to nail clippers, I'll cut them all short, like this sort of length and um, bow them all off and try and have them rounded. If the chip hairs come beyond that, I will paint them my own colour. Um, but like, these ones are pretty good. I've got a chunk, like a slight of a chunk missing out the thumb because I've got it with a potato peeler. This is something I don't procrastinate about. I will literally buy it as soon as possible. I try and keep a list of what I've got running out so if I know that I'm going sort of I probably need to boots or into town sort of on the weekend I will go through my makeup collection and I can mentally think like everything in my makeup collection be like is that running out are any of those running out and if I know something's on its way out I will repurchase so sometimes it will depend what time of the month and what it is that's running out but a lot of the times I will restock it within a week or I will online if it's high-end. Cleaning my blush brushes, <laughs> not cleaning my brushes, um, apart from not cleaning my brushes I have a really really oily t-zone um, as you'll probably know if you read my vlog and my biggest problem and everyone will tell you I will sit there and touch my face and it's really really bad especially because then it will cause me to break out like I'll touch my chin or my forehead, my worst places are like right in the creases of your nose is where I get the oiliest and I'll sit there and be like, oh I'm really oily and touch it and then try and wipe it and then that obviously makes it even worse Filling up my car, I literally can run on empty for three days and I'll make excuses like, it's not because of the money or anything, it's literally laziness I love getting ready to go out. Just like getting ready to film, I love the whole make a bath, have a good like Clarisonic cleanse, do all of the skin routine, and then put all your makeup on, then sort your hair out, and then get ready. And then I'm normally one of those people that's sort of sat waiting for my lift. No, I try <laughs> and give myself a spending round every every payday. Um, and I thought to myself this time, oh it won't be so bad in January because I'm going skiing so I'll be away for a week so that's a week of not spending except we had a day a week early or like four or five days early so it's like really organised um, it used to be an absolute shambles when I first started it was just in a bag as it got bigger I actually had those food and zip lock bags and I would write on front foundation pop -up, and then keep it in a cardboard box and then I was like no it's not good enough even though my friend at the time was really amazed at that and I thought that was amazing so and then I watched Sarella's beauty storage and she had like all these clear acrylic plastic boxes um, and she was like stacking them in and I've tried to do that I have bought those they were really really cheap um, but I've still got more products than I have space so which is why I've limited myself to like a bat like why I've limited myself to a certain number of products so I've only got like four foundations because that's all that fit in and I'm like no don't buy any more foundations wait until one runs out 
Um, I've still got quite a lot of room left in lipstick so I'm slowly filling them up with MAC. So all the questions done, um, I hope you enjoyed it. I actually really enjoyed answering them um, because normally in a tag when I do blogging I write them down first and then rewrite them so it was good answering them like straight off the top. So watch from Wednesday will probably be another tag because I'm really really enjoying the Makeup Honey um, tags and then they're a really good easy way to get into YouTube and for you to get to know me um, and I find them quite interesting to watch. Um, don't forget that I post every Monday, Wednesday, Friday on my blog, my blog is linked down below. Um, Friday's upcoming post will probably be most likely about my time in Austria, some photos, um, and then the Monday's post is most likely going to be a little haul because I picked some things up that haven't been delivered yet, so that would sort of be um, a little bit of ASOS stuff. and. Topshop and um, my iPad as well. If you buy anything from Duty Free, which hopefully I won't, but my spending down probably won't last. And then it will be back to Watch Me Wednesdays again. And I actually really enjoy like getting ready and filming these things. Um, yeah, definitely check out all of my social media. So I'll link my blog, my Twitter, my Instagram, my Snapchat, and my Facebook page down below. And yeah, if you have any questions you want to ask me or any things that you want to see, do comment on my blog or tweet me or just comment on any of my social media really and be sure to check me out on all those and I will see you next Wednesday. Bye.